Hi, I'm Ross Moran, and I'm Brendan Buckless, and welcome to the third edition of this old Kirby house. As you might remember in the second edition, we we're having some work done on the exterior, including the front door. As you can see, work is completed. Now we picked a really unique color for the front door to make it stand out. It's from the Benjamin Moore Affinity Color Series. It's called Seedling. Now let's go inside, check out some more stuff. Here we are in one of the upstairs rooms at the house and one of our favorite characteristics of this old house is the spectacular original trim here. And what we love about it most is it brings the character into the building and helps us date the house somewhat. Now our painters did a real wonderful job because original trim like this takes a lot of work to get the chip material off and fill some of the gaps in there. They did a really nice job, and that linen color looks excellent. Rather than go with conventional aluminum gutters or the historic wooden gutters, which re require uh, a great deal of maintenance, uh, we opted for a unique half round aluminum gutter and you could take a look at it right here. Uh, so it has that historic uh, uh, half round look that would have matched uh, traditional wooden gutters, uh, but it'll hold up much better against uh, the environment and uh, 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 conditions over time. The stars shining bright and they whispered from on high. You will be said goodbye. Blue moon up Kentucky, keep on shining. Shine on the one that's gone. Goodbye. All right, I'm here with Bill Battles from Village Plumbing here in Westport. Bill is handling our plumbing and the HVAC here at the Kirby House build. Bill, why don't you tell us a little bit about what you're working on? Sure. So at the Kirby House, we've got uh, two three and a half ton uh, heat pump systems. They do the heating and cooling and dehumidification for the project. The, um, the heat pump will take care of this for heating load technically down to minus 13 degrees at probably about 85 percent capacity to back that up on uh on really cold days it has electric resistance heat in there uh to help you know offset the heat pump on the really chilly days um the house is the building set up as three zones you know first floor second floor and then the the annex side is a separate zone itself with its own dedicated system <laughs> Thanks, Bill. For all your plumbing and HVAC needs, make sure you go to Village Plumbing. I said, the moon up, Kentucky, did you keep on shining? Shine on the one that got it through. This concludes episode three of this old uh, Kirby house. Uh, you can see our kitchenette is in progress, so stay tuned. Thanks again for all your support on this project. We look forward to sharing more with you in coming episodes. Blue moon up, Kentucky, keep on shine.